Good, Good morning, morning Saints. Saints. Guys, what? It's our turn to do Halo. Sorry. Fine. Good morning, Saints. Today is Thursday, October 12th, 2023. Happy birthday yesterday to Joss Quick and happy birthday today to Michael Kohler. The sin of the day today is St. Francis Xavier Silos. Francis Xavier was born in Bavaria. He studied Munich before coming to the United States to serve the German-speaking immigrants. He remained here his entire adult life, serving both his parishioners and fellow redemptorists. The St. Thomas Aquinas Parent Guild and Campus Ministry would like to invite all moms and all dads to attend Mass with your children. The first Tuesdays of every month will be moms, and the third Tuesdays will be for dads. Stick around for coffee and donuts immediately following Mass. We will begin this month with the dads on Tuesday, October 17th. Tuesday Masses are at 7.20 a.m. On the menu today in the Saints Cafe, we still don't know. Dang. The varsity boys soccer team celebrated its 10th se 10 seniors and John Wigman, Wig Wiggum last night with their fifth straight victory. This one over Blue Valley coming in overtime with a goal that went from Andrew Muckerman to Jaden Janeway to Liam Ryan for the overtime. 1-0 win. George Guagliano and Parker Lane team for the shutout. Congratulations to the freshman A volleyball team for a successful season. They closed out the season last night with two more victories, improving their record on the year to 27-1. Team members include managers Mia Garcia and Nick Thrasher, and players Morgan Bernard, Mabel Delaney, Maddie Eichmeyer, Lauren Crisman, Jaden Lee, Nayla Mora, Grace Nelson, Ireland Nelson, Blair O'Brien, and Bree Tuttle. Thanks for an awesome season. Girls Tennis starts their state tournament this Friday at the Salina Tennis Center. Good luck, ladies. The football team will play Blue Valley High School at Blue Valley at 7. Come out and support the team. The theme will be Men in Black. Here is Thursday Chats with Father C. Thanks guys, I'm Greta and we're back with Father C for another Chats with Father C. Quick question, Father, what was your favorite childhood Halloween costume? I had this big foam Twinkie costume. So it was like a big yellow square with a hole cut in. I wore that a lot, I like that one. <laughs> That's really creative. So today we wanted to talk about you becoming a chaplain here and becoming a priest in general. So how did you know you were being called to be a priest and were there any sacrifices you had to make for that? Yeah, in college I just, I came to realize that marriage wasn't going to satisfy me uh there was still something missing in my heart um and so yeah so i gave seminary a shot and it's obviously a big sacrifice is, is not getting married but it's there's way more blessings than sacrifices um yeah it's just being a priest is such an amazing amazing thing so yeah we appreciate having you here and we're really looking forward to this year with you so do you have any goals here at aquinas that you want to be as a priest i just want to be around um I love you guys. And when I was in high school, we didn't have a chaplain ever around. So yeah, just wanted to be here for you guys and just sort of share life together. So thank you. And as you see, we have this beautiful sign, admire, um, adoration and confession today during SCA period as it is Wednesday. So we have it on Wednesdays. Thanks, Greta. Teens for Life meeting this Friday, October 13th, second part of STA. Come find out about activities for the month with lots of works of ser mercy service hours. You should get up to you could get up to 17 hours of service in the next month for Teens for Life. And as always, treats. Would you like to earn service hours doing some face painting at an event on Shawnee on Saturday from 10:30 to 2? If you have an artistic flair and need service hours, please email Miss Spillman right now for details. This event is this Saturday, so if you're interested, respond now. Do you wonder why we do things the way we do? Do you have thoughts and opinions on enhancing policies and experiences at Aquinas? If so, then you may be a great candidate for a group being formed, the Saints Advisory Board. Look for the email Mr. Hallauer sent out and fill out the Google form to be considered. This would be a great way to be involved and learn about leadership. Now it's time for the dad joke of the day. Why do bees have sticky hair? Why? Because they use a honeycomb. Thank you for watching the Halo Morning Show. We'll be back with more for you tomorrow. I'm Victoria. And I'm Haley. Signing, Signing off. off. Remember, stay classy, saints, and together we shine.